Hey guys, what's up? How's it going? So obviously this is not a live stream. The reason is every once in a while uh, here and there I uh, do just uh, short videos and um, you know every once in a while you need to do short videos. I mean why not? The reason is I mean I used to make videos period. Um, they would vary from length to like, I don't know, from average of 10 minutes through 20, 25 minutes at the most. So, <clears throat> you know, I'm over here doing live streams and they, uh, they're they about, you know, shoot, almost up to an hour. So, you know, it's okay to do some short videos every now and then. Hello, movie star, John Chen. John Chen. Research for my role as a sexy cop stud for 13 rounds, extra innings. While detectiveating, I came across a constipation to commit a crime. What? I assume you mean conspiracy, Santino. Ah, constipation. Very good, Jenna. What I found is Cody Rhodes and Ted DiBiase are up to many things. Nothing I can arrest them for yet, but they will slip up, and when they do. Santino will be a spoke on the wheels of justice. Cry. It's everywhere. Detective Santino, he guards the night. Detective Santino. And he runs away. Where are you going? Hey, wh wait a freaking second. Where the freak are you running off to? Where's he gonna go? Hey, get your ass back. Wait. Oh. What? The freak just happened. Huh. And this car is always here. I don't know why. Something about this car bothers me all the time. Okay. Monday Night Raw is live from Omaha. Michael Cole and Jerry the King Lawler welcome you just six days away from Elimination Chamber. Former number one contender John Cena is still trying to get a title shot, but GM Randy Orton, who also happens to be WWE champion, has been less than supportive. With Elimination Chamber just on the horizon, can either John Cena or MVP find their way into the main event? We'll find out tonight. Huh. Let's see what happens. Let's get straight down to the business. What up, dog? Homeboy? All you have to do is... Still doing back here, Cena? Holy! Walk your skinny butt out to the ring. <laughs> MVP is waiting on you. Hey, what's your problem, Mark? I've just been hearing some things about you, Cena, and they're not good things. <laughs> that is hilarious. Let's go straight down to the ring because I want to know what's going to happen. Cena versus Mark Henry. Well, you pretty much ruined the moment when you put my name against, you know, the opponent. When you, when I have to talk to the person who I just met because that's just weird, man. Why would you do that? You know, they should have put a question mark instead. Doesn't make any sense at all. Huh. Oh, MVP got that couch, man. He's got it going on. In the ring, so that can only mean one thing. Big things popping, little things stopping. So <laughs> sit back, relax, and enjoy the view because the VIP lounge is for people like me and all of you. Wow. He's got them rhymes. I always gotten along with authority. And joining me tonight is someone else who the man is trying to keep down. Please join me in welcoming John Cena. <laughs> Look how he's walking like like a boss. Like ain't nothing's going on, you know, at all. He's just like not even worried, man. All cool. Wow. I like that Cena, you know. Walking in like a top dog. Alright, let's see what Cena's gotta say now. He's gonna for having me, MVP. First time guest, long time viewer. Love the show. And you're right. The man is trying to keep us down. Randy Orton is afraid either one of us is gonna snatch up his WWE championship. You bet your ass he is. He's so afraid he made himself general manager. <laughs> He's so afraid he started buying extra strength diapers. <laughs> Wait, he's so afraid. Okay, that's enough. 
Oh. This is so weird. Watching Randy Orton as the GM. You both view me as the bad guy. In that stupid suit that he's wearing. Little do you know, you're each much bigger enemies to each other than I could ever be. I mean, Cena, how many times has MVP tried to use you as a stepping stone? Tried to run you out of the WWE? Now, wait a minute, Randy. I admit, I used to be pretty devious myself. But it was nothing compared to the level you've sunk to. <laughs> and now you think Cena's your friend, MVP. Your partner. Well, he's not. But you don't have to take my word for it. What the? MVP could more than compete with you, John. I bet he could even beat you. MVP doesn't have it in him to do that. Not anymore. Ouch, John. But regardless of your low opinion of MVP, I think he's a more worthy number one contender than you are. Looks like Cena's talking. I've beaten him more times than I can count. What did I tell you? Wow. Cena, you're gonna play me like that? I don't mean to interrupt. That's so typical. Let you both know that you have matches at the elimination chamber against each other in a last man standing match. Oh, great! Whoop it, do. You can settle your differences there. How the heck? How the freaking heck? You put two guys in the last man standing match six nights or six days before the pay per view. Oh, yeah. Just have a matchup against this person, you know, in the last man standing match. Wow, what a way to build up the whole rivalry thing, you know? Wait a second. Do I. Do I not have a matchup? Cena versus Mark Henry. Okay. <laughs> I was like, what is going on? Am I going out? I guess I should have walked around, but... <laughs> oh, well. I'm going to beat Mark Henry. Then I'm going to make him... Believe! I don't know what's been going on with that. Tonight's uh, Raw is actually taking place from uh, Atlanta. And I'm not even going... I live near, I mean, uh, like 20 miles away, not 20, 60 miles away from Atlanta. And uh, we usually go from time to time. Last time they came, we uh, went to that SmackDown show, and uh, that was the last time we saw The Shield, which I'm kind of glad I did, because they uh, split up the next week. All right, time to focus. There we go. Yeah, get your ass back in the, oh, crap. Good gosh, hi. He has, dude. I have not done one single thing. Okay, come on now. Jeez, somebody's gonna get it. What the crap is going on, dude? I can't do anything. He cannot reverse anything. He oh, uh, that's what I'm talking about. Take that. Oh my gosh, I s Okay. The running grapples, apparently they don't work. Oh. The world's strongest man. Okay, what should C to be looking for now? He needs to start kicking and moving and wearing his opponent down. C to... That was a reversal mayhem. My gosh, the power of John Cena. Never give up. This is crazy. Ooh. Hustle, loyalty, respect. Those three mottos. Oh. Ah! He stood there like a champ and took it too. Alright, let's go up on top rope one more time again, man. I got this, I got this. Oh, crap. You got that right, nobody's home. I'm getting up. Oh. The heavy ass freaking knee? You lost your mind, son. 
Henry controlling the waist. Oh. Oh, man. Jeez. There should be escape near the ropes. Oh, there we go. I got this. I got this, mine. Mm. Yeah, tonight's Raw. I don't even know what it's going to be like. I, it's not very promising, I can tell you that. All right, man. Fix and get a uh, signature. There we go. Oh. That's press. Come on. All right, let's do a signature now. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. My top dog. Top homeboy. Oh, Wiz Khalifa and John Cena, they made a song together, and it's going to feature in the uh, 2K15 game. You believe that? I believe that. And everybody's been complaining that the song actually sucks. Ah, uh, it's one of those things people are just going to talk about it, whatever. All right, let's win this match. Come on now. One, two, three. That's what I'm talking about. Usually suck in every single match right in the beginning, and then I come out on top, just like you know the usual. Cena always wins. In an angry Mark Henry. I don't know whether Orton's footage is doctored or not, but some superstars hit first and ask questions later. And now it's Cena, an MVP. In last man standing match. Wow. That is so stupid. Isn't MVP? The uh, Rumble winner, so he gets to face the champion at WrestleMania. Like, I don't get that. And now here we are at the Rumble, you know. Wow. Or, I mean, uh, Elimination Chamber, that's what I meant. St. Louis. Freaking uh, Randy Orton's hometown. Alright, I have a message. Okay. Welcome, and thank you for joining us at Elimination Chamber, live from St. Louis. We have what may be one of the biggest grudge matches we've ever seen here tonight. We have three huge Elimination Chamber matches with championships on the line. And John Cena and MVP will square off in a last man standing match with so much at stake for each man. That's right, King. With bad blood flowing, Cena and MVP will collide in a showdown crafted by Raw General Manager Randy Orton. And once again, Cena's <laughs> actions got him in trouble. I have to disagree with you there, King. But we'll see what the future holds. I'm not listening to these guys anymore. I'm pretty much done with them. And there is MVP. There is hard truth. Hey, hold up. Where are you going, dog? Let me talk to you for a beat second. It, you beat it. Beat my dick. Uh, nobody cutting promo. I guess I'll just have to talk to him. I guess. Hey, you know I didn't say those things. I saw it with my own eyes, Cena. Heard it with my own ears, too. And you know what? It doesn't matter anyway. Whether it's a conspiracy or not, it doesn't change the fact that we stand in each other's way. And it has to end tonight. You're right. On the road to WrestleMania, it's every man for himself. But understand this. I'm a man of my word, and I did not say those things. So, I'm on my Twitter, and my friend is linking me all these uh, Randy Orton five or six second clips. It's uh, a guy who has made a page, and he makes these short video clips of uh, like real life edited with uh, Randy Orton's picture, and he just comes out of nowhere in RKO's. You guys know what I'm talking about if you guys stay on the internet. I'm sure you guys came across a bunch of those funny clips. He's linking me all those videos right now on Twitter when I already saw most of them like last week. A little too late. Oh, wait. Alright, um, so I guess I'll just uh, go ahead and get it started. Look at this. Swagger versus Hardy, Cena versus MVP, ECW Chamber, Raw, and SmackDown Chamber. Good times. Had three chamber matches in one pay-per-view. Huh. You know, people deserved a Seth Rollins and maybe... A Seth Rollins and Dean Ambrose um, elimination chamber match. But I don't know for what odd reason, you know, odd reason they didn't go for that. 
the direction of this company just keeps on changing. Here and there, there's all kinds of changes that come. So, I don't know. And the changes are not even that good. I mean, you can't... <laughs> Roman Reigns is out. Daniel Bryan is out. I mean, one other superstar is out right now. Daniel Bryan. Roman Reigns. Who's the another big one? I forgot. There's another one that's... That, um... Uh, wrestlers out. I can't. I don't know. I don't remember. I mean, I can't think about it on top of my mind right now. But let me go ahead and get started with uh, the beatdown on MVP. Come on, player. Take that chair. That's what I'm talking about. And I'm going to break your ankle, dog. That's for not believing me when I told you that I didn't say those words. Alright. Oh, good. Good. Gosh, PG are gone just like that. And now his head, <laughs> his face, his face. Oh wait, can I make a jump? That's gonna be awesome. Oh crap! What just happened? He just got out of the way, didn't he? Let's try it again. I can't pick up the chair. Oh, chair is broken. Great. Just what I needed. Well, nothing here because that's the same side I got that freaking chair from. Oh, look at this. <laughs> that punch. It was it was hit at the same time too. I kudos you for that, dog. Good job for punching me at the same time. Another chair. You mind? Come on. Where is the ref referee? Come on, get your ass back in here. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, DDT coming through. Boom. Nice. Bum my clock. John Cena is so electric. Even his penis is electrifying. Does that hurt? MVP? You know, I can win this match if I want to, but I want to explore. Wait a second. What? Last man standing match and the count out? Oh no, he's counting that he's... Okay, never mind. I was thinking, I was like, is he counting me out? I'm going to hit a signature to do a little bit more damage on his body. Boom. He should be bleeding right now. Can't see me. There's people chanting MVP. Sounds like some Ring of Honor area or arena crowd. Nope. Get. Oh, crap. Need to get out. Okay. There we go. Alright, can we play around here? I don't even know if we can or not. Let's see. Oh, crap. Can I do anything? In this corner? Oh crap. Reversal. Cena squeezing down on the head. Let's see. Oh, another reversal. Take that shoulder. Take that massive shoulder. Oh, let's try it again. What? Really, dude? Oh. Good gosh. That's a thin pad outside the ring. It offers absolutely no protection. That's what she said. No protection. Hmm. That's it. We're going to break some tables. Let's see what we can do here. There we go. Alright. Can I go up on top rope? Oh, come on. Get your ass up on top rope. Alright. Elbow drop. Good gosh! Never seen that before. But it happened. Ooh, my gosh. That's going to leave a mark. That's it. This should be it. Watch out, Riff. Alright. That's the ending of this matchup. Mm -hmm. 
You can't see me. Man, I can't wait for 2K15. Somebody told me that there was a glitch that somebody came across. A video they saw. And, uh, it was a glitch. I just don't know what kind, but it was a glitch. What are you guys doing? Hey, I'm going to take off your stuff from the table. You mad? See the wins. Lol. Insert that Vince McMahon meme. So I'm guessing MVP is out of the way right now. Cena had a job to do, and he did it well. Sometimes you have to do things in life you don't want to do, and that was the case tonight for Cena. Randy Orton orchestrated this whole thing in my eyes. Orchestrated. Competing later tonight. Will Raw's general manager leave St. Louis with the WWE Championship? That is so weird. Raw's GM. WWE Champion at the same time. I wonder if they're going to show that. I think they are. They ought to be. If not, then I'll keep in suspense for you guys. For the next episode, for sure. Tacoma, Washington. Well, they went to the next episode. I mean, uh... Next show. And I guess that's it. We'll keep it a suspense. You got a voicemail from Randy Orton. Mr. Last Man Standing, I'm requesting you come to my office as soon as possible. Ooh. Thank you for your compliance. Wow. What a douche. Alright, I'm going to save this. And, uh, wait, I want to save it in a different, just in case. Alright. I'm going to save this and um, call it a day. Thank you guys for watching this lovely episode. I will see you guys next time. Please give me a like on this video if you guys can.